Nova Max Advanced Technology Plus, the blood glucose monitoring system. Um, it's got no coding needed, tiny blood sample, fast five second glucose results, glucose testing on finger or arm, glucose and ketone testing in one meter, thin 33 gauge lancets. The American Diabetes Association now recommends blood ketone testing. So we should see the drop of these items because these are way expensive. But I had uh, done uh, kind of a tutorial on, on this Precision Extra and I did kind of a comparison back up of this contour. I do like this, although these guys uh, are outdated and so is this control solution. This worked out really well. And if we kind of, uh, that was uh, fasting at the end of the day. But, um, and that is, I don't remember when that was. Oh yeah, that is my buddy Charlie. Uh, that is the actual control solution. Yeah, and so those are basically my numbers thus far. I mean, I've, I've also gone through. So that was actually the um, control solution on this, on this particular meter. But there's, see, there's an expiration date of 07, 2008. So we might go ahead and bring all these out and um, might go ahead and bring all these out and um, do a comparative test. Um, so we'll go ahead and put these to the side, although I don't have my strips over here. So <clears throat> these are all out. I do have uh, those strips so we can do a comparison on, on these. Um, so um, let's go ahead and uh, open up the uh, box first. So basically we have an expiration date of 01-2018. I'm not even sure what that means and that's probably referring to, um, that's probably referring to the stuff here, the control solution and your glucose for self-monitoring, uh, management of glucose, ketones, refrigerate, kit contains small parts, set of reach of children, three years limited warranty. Um, basically, this is sort of what we're looking to get. And then there's a serial number. Um, yeah, and so from the American Diabetes Association states that blood ketone testing is preferred over urine ketone testing as more reliable method of diagnosing and monitoring diabetic ketoacidosis. So it's basically saying, hey, this can work with uh, ketone test strips and glucose test strips. And uh, basically there are two test strips. So let's go ahead and open this guy up. And anytime I open up a box, I usually like to uh, just kind of bend and fold just in case I'm ever going to take this back. So obviously we've got a very large box for not a lot of items. Let's see how many items we actually have. Yes, our, our standard travel bag, which is usually not very effective. Oh, look at all these pamphlets. Yay. And the log book. Now, just to let you know, I've had uh, just had four eggs uh, on a bed of spinach um, with just a little bit of grass-fed butter and some coconut oil. That's basically um, all I've had. Um, so here's what we have. We have the, um, we got 10 glucose test strips. Okay, we got a control range um, of 82 to 127 milligrams, I guess. Um, uh, milligrams per deciliter. So discard six months after opening this container. So there's a place to put your date right there. We've got uh, our control solution. So we can, uh, this will help um, potentially deal with um, any troubleshooting that we'd have to do. Okay. Um, we've got... We got our lancet uh, and our lancer. So basically, we can just kind of rip this off somewhere. And oh my gosh, this is probably the same as we've always uh, had been reading. So. Oh, now we've got the same thing. We've got that alternative test site cap. Um, consult, da 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 da, by gently pushing it down and away, da 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 da. So, this is basically all the same thing. So, uh, oh, oh, this is really good information. Okay, so uh, we got this, uh, got this really cool logbook. No, yeah, we got this uh, really cool logbook. Um, oh my gosh, that's so interesting. Oh my gosh. Um, we've got this, oh, a warranty, oh my gosh, because I didn't spend much money at all that I really care about a warranty. So, now with this, it's very important to go ahead and, uh, you gotta fold these edges for this warranty to take effect, you know? 
And you just go, you just want to be really delicate with this whole thing because, uh, you know, at any moment. Oh, whoops. So we got a little, got a little. All right. Hey, look. Glucose, uh, Nova Max Glucose Test Strips. Okay, so I believe that's referring to this guy. Okay, I, I'm not really going to read all that. Okay. And then, but actually, this one actually looks like it's got some better information. Um, okay, so that's actually a book that I would actually hold on to, but we could find it online. That's obviously in Spanish, so I'll do that one here. This is a, a kind of a well laid out uh, diagram here. Okay, so I'd hold on to this guy and just keep that with you. Okay, so you can use basically any one of these here. I mean, I mean any of these is going to pull blood. I don't know what the difference would be. So we got five ketone test strips in each container. And then we've got our, uh, all right, so let's go ahead and take off the, the cover here. Got a little uh, feet here, so we can kinda, it's a standard battery. So we're gonna wanna pull this out. So actually that's there to help pull the battery out. Okay, so this is a uh, 2470. 3 volt 24 7 and this strap just helps us pull the battery out so we'll go ahead. that's a that's a that's a big honking battery right there we can just fold that back in so it is um, thirteen. Got a little grip here. Basically, we'll be putting it in from the top there. So let's go ahead and do a glucose test first on that finger and then maybe the ketone on that finger. So let's go ahead and put this ketone bottle away. And uh, I think we should do uh, a test. A, um, test the machine. Okay, so basically, let's go ahead and... Just stick this in here, okay, like that. Daddy? Yeah? Sorry to bother you. But You're fine. I'm, I'm, above the, above, I'm a bit hungry. Okay. Yes. I'm going to go ahead and try it on a three at first, okay? And so, the important part here, for me, is I'm going to push down hard, and so when I jam this into my side, it's I'm putting so much pressure on that, I mean, it's not going to hurt me. So, let's go ahead and put that in, okay, and then let's get a control solution reading. Let's see if we shake it up even more.
Okay, so I think what we're supposed to do is be pretty close to 100. Now, I don't think that's enough, so I think we just need to move it up to 4. And then just go to 5. Okay? That kind of hurt. So that's just me just eating quite a bit. That's uh, it's a little high. To be honest. But I did eat quite a bit. Now we'll do one of these. Now I really don't want to throw one away. Just on a control solution. But... So E5. Wow, you go up to E4. Cool. goes up to E4, so I'm not sure what E5 is. Good, that's one. And that's supposed to be... Now this is the moment of truth because I haven't checked my ketosis levels and then we'll see where I can go from here.